Are you troubled by strange noises in the night? Do you experience feelings of dread in your basement or attic? Have you or your family actually seen a spook, specter, or ghost? If the answer is yes, then don't wait another minute. Just pick up the phone and call the professionals. Call the Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters. We're, We're ready, ready to, to believe, believe you. you. Franchises available soon. Call for details. Whoa! Russell, hey man. You knew the East Wing? Yep. But by the new ghost or exhibit? Yeah, why? There's something headed your way. Wait. I hear something. I'm gonna take a look. Wanna hear something really creepy? I was reading about Shandor, you know, the guy who donated most of the Gozer stuff. He was into the occult. You know, supernatural. Weird dude. <laughs> uh, well, why don't we talk about it some other time? Any other time. Hey, you can't be in here. Stop! Ghostbusters, is your haunting an apparition, poltergeist, phantasm wraith, banshee demon specter, tortured solar? What? No, we do not summon dead family members and catch them so you can ask the combination to the safe. Yeah, well, same to you, pal. Hey, it's the new cadet! Welcome aboard! This might be a little dangerous. Great. Danger is our life. We'll start at 50% capacity. That should keep any burning or tissue damage to a minimum. Hey, if you're gonna burn any tissue, do it to the new kid. You can't use Ray. Our mortgage is in his name. I guess he's right. What's your name again, kid? No names, Ray. I don't want to get too attached to this kid. You know, just in case. <laughs> you remember what happened to the last guy. He's tuned and ready to go. You may feel a little tingle. Good. We've perfected an extensive and rigorous training regimen that will teach you all your equipment's basic functions. It takes some time to achieve master throw skill, but it's definitely worth the effort. Was that us? I don't think so. Ray? Had to be some sort of psi energy pulse. Substantial. A significant collected and centralized necromantic convulsion level 7 or more. Agreed. We need EMF measurement checks now. I know the answer, but I'm going to ask anyway. Is a level 7, uh, whatever, bad or very bad? On a scale of 1 to 10, I would say... Let me guess. It's a 7. Let's just say we're about to get real busy. And that is not the fun kind of getting busy, is it, Ray? Look out! Slimer's escaped again! No, wait, come back. There it is. It seems oddly drawn to the containment grid. He's been fascinated with it ever since you added the viewer to the unit. Okay, easy now, cadet. I'll talk you through this. Use the proton stream to get his attention. That's some highly sensitive equipment you're disintegrating there, kid. Yeah. Oops, you let one out? That's my fault. I was fine-tuning the interspatial gasket this afternoon. I'll fix it. You two get those ghosts back. Hey, this will work out great since you're already strapped into a pack. It's a perfect opportunity for some training. Taking the right precautions, Slimer's harmless. Uh, more or less. Not sure about the other guy, though. Okay.
first and foremost, before things get out of hand. You want to get to know your proton pack. It can be your best friend out there in the field. Everything you need to know is displayed on the pack itself. Here's where you keep an eye on your current physical condition. The more green that's on the bar, the more damage you can sustain and still stay on your feet. This bar indicates your pack's heat level. When it gets to the top, you'll want to bend the pack and keep it from shorting out and resetting. For the most part, capturing a ghost is pretty straightforward. We break it into three basic steps. Sap them, cap them, and trap them. Spectral entities derive all their strength from an accumulation of PK energy. Blasting them with your proton screen or other offensive equipment helps to dissipate that energy. Dissipating their PK energy also makes them easier to capture. Do it again! See that overlay on the ghost? It indicates the current accumulation of a ghost's PKE. The more you disperse, the weaker it becomes. Pack's moving into the red, connect, Bennett! And I thought Slimer was disgusting. <laughs> All right, you've got it good and winded. Next stage, cap them. You can project the capture stream or wrangler manually using this control. On the other hand, the pack will detect when a ghost is sufficiently weakened and auto-select the capture stream setting. Get in there and throw a capture stream on that tub of boo. <laughs> Fantastic! You got it! As soon as your ghost is in your capture screen, the slam meter begins to slowly charge. If you want to accelerate the slam meter charge, you can wrangle or counter wrangle the ghost to the end of the line. Here's how you do that. Watch the ghost. When you make the dash in one direction, you pull the screen quickly in the other. Give it a shot! That's it! Perfecto! Looks like it still has some fight left in it! Make sure your pack slam meter is charged. Let him have it! Pow! That's right! Now we can move to stage three. Trap him. You're gonna need some place to put that. Throw out your trap! See the beacon signal coming from the closed trap? That when it goes left, you pull to the right. Just like charging up the slam meter, but faster. And there! Oh yes! One escapee accounted for. Oh, and always remember to retrieve your trap. Did you get them? Ah, uh, we're batting 500. Slimer slipped out. Our cadet bagged his first one, though. A very nasty customer. Oh, and you've got to be very careful about crossing the streams. In a word, don't do it. Seriously. Stings like the Dickens, too. Hey, how come this mump gets all the new stuff? He's our new experimental equipment technician. He gets a cool title, too? It means he gets to carry around a bunch of untested, extremely dangerous hardware that, if not handled correctly, could blow him somewhere into New Jersey. Oh, this knucklehead lugs around our very dangerous prototype hardware that could potentially blow us into New Jersey. Thanks. Keep the title, kid. It'll work hard for you. Scooter? We need to go. Let's roll. Where to, Ray? The Sedgwick Hotel. That's the first place that little spud will go. Right. Back to its initial manifestation point. They've got a real good buffet. It is a great one. When Winston returns from the opera, extend an invitation to join us at our table at the Sedgwick. Hey, you! You're up, buddy. Training will be on the job tonight. Try not to destroy too many Manhattan landmarks. That's our job. That disgusting green blob is up on the 12th floor again, wreaking havoc. I demand a refund right now. Sir, if you check the fine print on our invoice... Invoices. <laughs> right, invoices. You'll see that your warranty on rehaunting expired some time ago. You should have taken the extended service agreement.
I'm getting some interesting PKE spikes here. Disturbances don't seem to be exclusive to the 12th floor. I'd like the chance to look around the building a little more. Good. Dig up what you can. That little greenie oh, shouldn't cause us too much trouble. Well, hello. You're perfectly safe now, Mess. The Ghostbusters are here. Back off, loser. Never gonna happen. <laughs> that approach rarely works with me. I'll show you why later. All right, Ace. Get ready. Dr. Stance, if you'd do the honors. Proud to, Dr. Venkman. Part of our settlement with the city, proton packs must remain off in heavily populated public areas. And in close quarters. It minimizes the city's liabilities and satisfies the restraining order the maid here had put on us. Where we live in today, you shoot a proton stream of highly charged particles at someone, they get all so happy. It's him! Nice. Now we got another plaintiff. Oh, come on, Ray. I'm the one that gets a face full of slime every time the little green buddy escapes. He doesn't even know me well enough to hate me. Watch it! Contact! Ah, yo! Jeez! We're burning daylight, Pilgrim. Can we get out of here? Wear him out, then we capture him. That's what your proton stream is for. You've got him on the run! Come on, let's go! Peter! Nah, I've seen this one already. Know how it ends. You two have fun, though. I'll cover the elevators and escort any ladies safely to their rooms. Yeah, okay. And this signal looks just like your elusive little targeted entity. Your meter will flash and buzz when it detects a potential signal. The paragoggles are linked directly to your active PKE meter. This lets you see otherwise undetectable phenomena while you track it. Ghost trails, object auras, all kinds of cool events. Now when the center bar peaks, you're headed in the right direction. When it's flat, you're following a cold trail. Line the target up with the smallest circle for the best scan. Okay, you way to go! Red signifies a hidden ghost. Green indicates an environmental paranormal anomaly. Blue means an active sample. Getting warmer. You're red hot! Careful. Getting a good scan is sort of like taking careful. He's definitely been here. An active sample is something you can collect, like a cursed art. Artifact. We get paid extra for everything we scan and collect. Then we roll it back into research and development. The extra funds let us experiment with new equipment and offensive technologies, which in turn, you get to wear on your back to test. Remember, you can always review techniques, tutorials, and equipment in your online Ghostbusters field manual. It's all accessible from your PKE meter. Ready! I don't feel good! Peter, come in. You okay? Uh-oh, man down. We've got a man down. Go, go, go! 
Come on, shake a leg. You can move faster than that, can't you? Double time, cadet. He's been slimed again. Hustle over here and help him up, will you? How did this even happen? I was covering the elevators. That mutant Stromboli snuck up on me. <sighs> Funk the fire again. When one of us goes down, we always help each other out. It's all about teamwork. Oh no, my friend. That was back in the pre-sliming era. Right now, it's all about payback. You guys need to get down here immediately. Our living science experiment is tearing apart the lobby, and he's not alone. More ghosts? But we gave this hotel a clean bill of health five years ago. New people die every day. Call the elevator, Junior. All right, Slimer. You've had your fun. The elevator's off limits. Egon, come in. I think we're stuck in the elevator. We need some help. Think we're stuck. Well, let's see. Think we're stuck? Think we're stuck? Think we're stuck? Ray, you guys uh, good with officially stuck in the elevators? Show of hands. Here it comes. Kill it, Ray! Need a hand? You always fail, don't you? Never mind the onion head for now. Ghost with the red cap is quite the time to stay. Come on, he's a New York fan. Yeah. Just quack. <laughs> Watch it, streams are crossing. Work it out. You own oh, that creep. They felt that one in Pittsburgh. Shockwave really stirred the nest. Man, this lobby is so wrecked. Can we please call Winston and tell him his night off is officially ended? <laughs> More of them! Why are you running? Why are you running? They've split up. Ray, follow me. The others are floating back upstairs. Bankman, you two pull our friend Slimer into a trap as fast as you can. There's a massive bulge in these spikes indicating this isn't just some routine clearing job. He gets so busy when he hasn't had his nap. Hey now, is that honey-glazed ham and prime rib? There, the Alhambra ballroom. 
No way he could pass that up. Absolutely not! You can't go in. The Rodriguez bar mitzvah is set to start in half an hour. I'll bet the beef brisket is today's special. And you've done quite enough already. I'm sure the thing will just go away. <laughs> I, I'm willing to risk it. You're not going in there. That's all we needed to hear. All right, we're out. Coffee time, everyone. Service has been declined beyond this point. Sounds like the Alhambra's off limits. The schnutz, you say? Nobody slimes Pete Beckman twice and gets away with it. Be careful, Peter. Remember the Ellis Island incident? You bring your apron? We're gonna take a little shortcut through the kitchen. The Alhambra should be right through here. Hello, chef. Okay, champion, you leave for a while. I right, don't touch the slime. It's slimy, and it's extremely dangerous. Yeah, you think I'd be used to that stuff by now? Nothing to worry about. Most kitchens have self-starting pilot lights. I dare you. Everything but the kitchen sink. This is why I need that. All right, check this out. To trap them, you've got to grab them, and to grab them, you use the other half of the proton on the capture stream. That's all there is to it. You just throw this junk anywhere. <laughs> we don't stick around and clean up. You know, I thought that guy said Rodriguez Parmesan. Huh? Would it kill him to mix in a green salad once in a while? I'm gonna take back him. Blast him until he's dazed and until you capture stream. It, buddy, you got the little monster breathing hard. Oh. 
Now, try to hold him still. You gotta wear him down. When he's tired, he'll be able to put his sorry crater of a butt into the truck. Alright, traps in. You're almost there. Guide him in. that pitiful goop sack to slime P. Vengman. And by extension, you. Perhaps a place sitting disturbed, still pretty much ready, full go for the Rodriguez blowout. The Alhambra Ballroom, the Bar Mitzvah, what have you done? The guests are arriving in 15 minutes. What seems to be your problem? Thanks to me and my new exclusively assigned recruit here, the festivities can now proceed in an entirely ghost-free environment. So, you're welcome, huh? And uh, to the Rodriguez, a from the Ghostbusters. 